matrix in MATLAB is very simple. So here we'll see how we can do that. So we want to get the eigenvalue and eigenvalue of the matrix A. Okay, so what we'll do in the MATLAB, we'll write this command only. Only five line you have to write, five to six line only you have to write to get that eigenvalue and eigenvector of a matrix. So here, first four line, we're writing the matrix A here. Okay, so first one comma one, we get writing five, and that is your basically one comma one, basically this one. Okay, this is one and this is two. Okay, so column number one, column two, this is row one and row two. So we write that first one comma one and one comma two. So one comma two, second first or second value. Okay, second column and then writing the second row 2 comma 1 and 2 comma 2 5 so if you write you will get your a matrix okay now if you want to find if you want to find eigen value and eigen vector then you have to write in this way in bracket v comma d here you can change the variable you can write anything you can write eigen vector okay then i in comma i again value you can change the variable name okay but right hand side you have to write in the same way v com so here in third bracket v comma t that is equal to eigen of a so basically what we're doing we're asking madlab to solve that eigen value problem for the matrix a and to give you the eigen value and eigen vector okay so here what happened you will get that eigen value four and six and Eigen vector like the first eigen vector like this and second eigen vector like this. Okay, so now if you want to present in a graphical way, you can present it like this: this is minus 0 0.7071 and plus 7071. Here, yeah, second one. This is not the eigen vector. That will define the. Okay, this other vector than the eigen vector. Okay, now here you can see in the matlab what actually I am doing. So you can see here. I just write four line. This clear comment in CLC you can give to clear your screen and your other previous calculation. Okay, only this line matrix and only this comment is enough to get. Okay, so now if you run that file, okay, so what you are getting basically you are getting your eigenvalue and eigenvector. Eigenvalue you are getting here in the diagonal matrix. As a diagonal, so D term as a diagonal, so first eigenvalue, second eigenvalue, and here you can find that eigenvector that we've defined as a variable V. Okay, now if you want to plot it, okay, directly you can plot from here, you can plot from here, okay, or you can give some comment in the MATLAB to plot it. So here the comment is your plot comment V, the first column, first column is your first vector, second column is the second vector. So I give plot first column like this only, and I this give this comment to define the line color, line width, marker size, marker line like this. Okay, and this one is second eigen vector, and I change the color to yellow. Okay, now if you run, you can see I am getting this vector. Okay, so like this way you can basically obtain eigen value and eigen vector in MATLAB. Thank you.